Uh, we're here in the San Rafael Swell. <laughs> That's a bumpy sucker. Hondo Arch. Hi, Mom. Well, we stopped to scout out a campsite. Buddy, where are your shoes? Oh, I have a bottle. We got stuck in some soft sand. Took us a little while to get out of. They were thinking we might camp right here under these cottonwoods. Now we're in the shade of that little cottonwood tree. It's perfection. So we're basically right underneath the Hondo Arch. Very cool. Kebabs on the menu tonight. Then we're going to do a little bit of baking. I think we're going to bake a pound cake. We've got some raspberries and whipped cream. Time to get set up to do these shish kebabs. And I actually brought some lump charcoal, some natural, I think it's hickory charcoal. One thing I was noticing about these smaller bags is the way you can load them up however you want them. See how I've got that fairly flat? And I did it that way because I have my pot set up with the inner pan on top, so there's less space up on top. But that's kind of the nice thing about these is you can kind of, uh, they just kind of conform to however much stuff you put in there. I did it this way because I had a ton of stuff. I've got this stuff here, and then I've got a ton of stuff inside the actual pot. So I've got the Nano sitting right there on top. And then the pot itself is absolutely packed full. You can fit quite a bit of stuff on this little stick. Yeah, you can. This natural lump charcoal seems to run a little hotter. I think these are pretty much ready to eat. Nope. Ooh, yeah, I think these are perfect. How is it? Really good. Where is another? 
Dad. Thank. Yes, please. Thank you. This butter is for the pound cake we're making. And I think it might be good to just brown it a little bit. A bit of browned butter flavor might be really good. Go ahead and put my rocks in. I would just be like, well, you know what? I'm a redhead. This really doesn't work out for me well. Here's my red dirt can line. Brandon would be proud. <laughs> you super tan and I burn in five seconds. Like, I got sunburn, I'll let you know. So we're out at lunch and we're outside, you know, and it's really hot that day. Mm -hmm. And I got sunburned the day before, so I was just kind of like, you know. <laughs> and then Brandon puts his arms out on the table like this and he's like, I'm going to get tan. And I'm like, I'm going to get burnt. Okay, so we just need to keep a few water bottles around for hiking. I'm just going to spread these rocks out a little bit. I've learned to go with a really low temperature down below, that's why I only have the hot coals, and then you want to get as much heat up top as possible. So I'm going to use the pocket bellows to stoke these hot coals up on top. Uh, is that for a bell? Is that a line? It's a clothesline, yep. Camping clothesline. Our temperature is up to 300 degrees. Okay, we've been running the oven for 25, maybe 30 minutes. The temperature has just been holding right at 300 degrees. Oh my goodness. Oh my gosh, it rose. It didn't overflow, but it certainly filled up the pan. Does anyone want to drink a milk? Yeah. Oh my gosh, it smells amazing. I found a little stick. Let's go ahead and see if it comes out clean. Oh my gosh, that looks beautiful. It came out clean. Let's see what we got here. Oh, look at that. It did brown on one part. It browned right in the middle. That looks That's pretty. Let's see if we can get this to come out of the pan here. Mm. Oh, look at that. Oh, it my came gosh. It perfectly. That's gorgeous. Look at that. How was that? I want to put strawberries and little cream on it. Mm -hmm. And I want cake, you want cake, and who wants cake, and other wants cake. Yeah. Where's and my mom wants, wants cake. I have a mouthpiece. <laughs> Where's the... Just a second, oh, baby. Oh my gosh, it looks good. Can I put back berries? Let me do it so we can have enough for everybody. Okay, let's put some on top. Yeah, look at that. I want that one. Well, the camera is. <laughs> it just came All right, me get out. me a plate. <laughs> what do you think, Em? This is like, this is like <laughs> one of the best. Look at that, huh? Oh, look at that. Oh, Top three camping desserts for sure. Gorgeous. <laughs> That's cool. Here, Isla girl. Um, do it. No, Luke has the ready whip again. <laughs> alert, up? alert. Loaded weapon. Hey. There he goes. This is amazing. It's so good. Mm -hmm. This is going to be my All food. right, look at that. It's beautiful. I got All right. it. Oh, wow, that is good. So, so okay, so that so never did like, reach 350 oh. degrees. It never did. Not even again. No. How is it, Luke? Good. It's going to be the door. Open this one.
Good morning. It's time to make my cup of joe. See if I can get this to go. Let's take a look. I like to let it settle in for a little while so that I have some head space that I can give it another kind of splash to help stir it. Well, beautiful spot, very beautiful day, nice overcast skies, beautiful light. Mm, what do you think about waking up here? Just a couple more. Uh, like Put that on the table, bub. Okay. We'll get out the fire starter too. We almost got the fire started. We're not gonna start the big fire, we're just gonna start the fire box. Do you wanna help me start that? I like starting that. Good. in the video. These tongs are great for bacon management. And you can even pick up hot coals and stuff with them. Very nice. 